It was the winter of 2019 when the world first encountered the novel coronavirus. Now, in December 2023, we find ourselves grappling with yet another variant, J.1, a descendant of the Omicron lineage. The World Health Organization has classified J.1 as a variant of interest. While it poses a low risk to public health, it is rapidly spreading across the globe, with cases detected in countries such as India, China, the UK and the US. But a strange trend is now observed in this pandemic. COVID-19 saw three big mutations in December of 2020. Those are Alpha or B.1.1.7, Beta or B.1.351 and Gamma or P.1. A year later, in December 2021, the Omicron variant sent the world back into their homes just months after lockdowns began to ease. The next year, in December of 2022, while there was no emergence of a new major variant, we saw the rise of sub-variants such as BA.2 and BA.5, all classified within the Omicron branch of the coronavirus. And now we have the J.1 variant, which also belongs to the Omicron lineage. So, the question arises, why December? Several studies have pointed to the cold and dry winter as an accelerating factor behind the surge in COVID-19 cases. A study published in the journal Nature was conducted to analyse the onset of the second wave triggered by the Delta variant. It showed that during the first wave of the pandemic, weather conditions affected how easily the virus spread. As we moved from summer to winter, the temperature dropped and the air became drier, contributing to an intense second wave of COVID-19 in countries in the Northern Hemisphere. Researchers at China Sichuan International Studies University also confirmed a similar hypothesis. Their study found out that participants living in cold conditions reported a higher likelihood of contracting the coronavirus than participants in controlled or warmer conditions. Moreover, the holiday season marked by increased social gatherings and travel is identified as a significant factor contributing to the rapid spread of JN.1. With international travel returning to pre-pandemic levels in 2023, experts stress the need for caution. However, they have pointed out that travel is an augmenting factor rather than the main cause of the surge. As we approach the end of the year and celebrations begin, health experts stress the importance of strengthening our immune defences through vaccination and mask wearing. The invisible nemesis still lingers and vigilance remains our strongest ally. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.